Hey guys, Shan here. Today I'm going to show you a quick and easy way to get a grunge look from your image. See I have a nice image here. First thing I'm going to do is start with new adjustment layer, black and white. Now I hit OK and CS3 has got different presets. I'm going to choose the infrared since it's a very high contrast. I hit OK. Now I'm going to change the blending mode on this layer to multiply. It's going to really bump my contrast, give me a dark, edgy look. I'm going to adjust my fill and opacity to where I like it. Here, I'm going to use about an 80. And now, it's got that edgy look. I'm going to take it another step. I'm going to do a pattern overlay on that black and white layer. So I hit that. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is turn that to multiply the blending mode. And one of my favorite uh, textures to use is parchment, since there's no real pattern to it. Um, really gives it that that textury look that I like. Turn the opacity down and the scale up to to suit the picture. Uh, so this is my quick and easy way to get a grunge look. You can see the before and the after. I like the the effect. Looks real nice and it's pretty popular now. So anyway. Hope you enjoy this. See you next time.